to every Disney movie ever. My name is Justin. I'm watching every Disney movie ever today. I'm going to talk about Stitch the Movie. Stitch the Movie is a 2003 animated directed video release. It's directed by Tony Craig and Bob Scanaway. Animation direction done by Hing Du Lim, Greg Vanzo, and Han Sang Yop. Editing done by Tony Mizgolski, music by Michael Tavera, and it's written by Jess Winfield and Bob Scanaway. The film got the original cast back, so Davy Chase is back as Lilo, Chris Sanders is back as Stitch, uh, Tia Carrere is back as Nani, um, David Ogden Steer is back as Jumba, uh, Kevin McDonald back as Pleakley, and Ving Rams back as Cobra Bubbles. The film uh, had a 20% on Rotten Tomatoes and is like the pilot ish of the television series is just supposed to lead into the television series. It feels very like disjointed and glitchy sometimes. Like it feels like they're very still, but their mouths are moving. Um, it feels very much like a television release, but like maybe a smidgen nicer. Like it's not as bad as Hunchback of Notre Dame 2 or like Aladdin Return of Jafar, but it's not as good as some of the direct video releases we've got. I don't have very strong opinions toward this because I feel like it's very average. I feel like it's really obvious that they were setting up for a television series because like the deal with the, all of the experiments, I was like, this feels very much like they're gonna spend an episode on each alien, which sets them up for 623 episodes. I don't know if they did that many. I have no idea. I know nothing about the television series, except now maybe what the premise was. Um, but it felt very just like fine. I'm glad it was one follow through story compared to some of the ones that have been a collection of shorts. I liked that. Otherwise it was like, it wasn't horrible, but it wasn't the most entertaining story. It also like definitely dumbed itself down. I feel like the original movie is really genuinely funny. It's got some really smart humor in it, or really like doomsday humor in it with Lilo, but in this one it was less so. They had a moment that made me laugh, which was when Lilo turned to Stitch and said, you can spit acid on them if you want, to the girls, which made me laugh so hard. Because that's how Lilo was in the first movie, and she was less like that in this one except for that moment, so I was looking forward to more of that, especially because like my love for the first one has been revitalized since watching it for this, so I was a little disappointed in that, I suppose. But it wasn't bad. Like, I was never bored, I guess. The movie did fly. Um, but it just, like, could have been so much better, I feel like. And had a lot more heart because the first one has so much heart. Um, but it was almost hard to do that because it was basically like they would have just been doing the exact same story with a different alien, I suppose. So, I don't know. It was, it was fine. That's everything I have for Stitch the Movie. Go ahead and give it a watch, I guess. My final rating is four experiments out of 600 and, you know, that's a really bad ratio. Four out of 10. It, like, so whatever that would be out of 626. <laughs> okay, we can do math. Um, Paratest Hole and Cry Count are still the same. If you want to keep up with the movie watching when, follow me on Instagram and Twitter. You'll find out movie watching when. I put up videos every Monday and Friday and sometimes Wednesday. Join Patreon. Got a tier starting at just $1. You get every video a week early and you get a coupon code for merch. Tiers above that. Daily trivia. Daily trivia goes off, okay? I've come up with so many questions. Y'all need to get over there and do that. Um, weekly random facts, monthly podcasts, the whole shebang. So get on over there, okay? Great. Buy merch. Merch is great. You can't buy this anymore. This was limited edition. Baby, the people who have this are the people who have this. Until next time, comment, like, subscribe, but I'm not in charge of real life. You are, so you do, and don't be hamster veal about it. Or Captain Gantu. Homeboy's got a problem. <laughs>